Hello and welcome to this My Theme Shop video screencast. Over the next couple of minutes, I'm going to be showing you how to set up the WP Review Pro plugin, which is an all-in-one solution for creating a review site within your WordPress installation. So the first thing you need to do is to download the plugin and you want to do that by going to the My Theme Shop members area at mythemeshop.com slash go slash member and you want to scroll down to your active premium resources there and at the bottom of premium resources you're going to find your premium plugins and we want WP Review Pro and you want to click download plugin files and I'm going to save that to my desktop there and then once that's downloaded you want to go to your WordPress dashboard and go to plugins and then add new and you want to upload plugin and just click choose file and select the zipped file which you've just downloaded. So I've got WP Review Pro.zip. Gonna click open on that and install, which is going to upload and install the plugin. Once that's done, you just need to click activate. And you now have the plugin activated. So to make use of the plugin settings, you want to go to settings and then WP Review. And here we have the global settings, so displaying across your whole site here. Um, for the WP Review plugin. So here you can set the review location. You can have it before, after, or custom using a shortcode. I'm going to set this to after content. You can have a review color. So if I just set that to a, to a light gray there. A font color, heading background color, background color, and a border color. I'm just going to uh, perhaps lighten that slightly. And I'll leave the rest of it is. And you can see you can also set the review width. So I'll set that to 90% and we'll align that right. You can also add here the default features. So this is um, uh, the items on your reviews that are gonna show up by default. For example, uh, you might want to put, uh, perhaps have one for features and one for usability perhaps. Those are gonna show up on all your reviews by default and you can add as many as you like there. You can also choose whether to have a total rating added to your thumbnails. So this is gonna be anywhere where you've got thumbnails displayed on your WordPress theme, so for example, on your homepage. And you can see here I have a lot of custom thumbnails sizes here, and you just want to tick all the ones that you want here. I want to have it everywhere, so I'm going to tick all of those and just click Save Changes. And those settings have saved, and these are where you can change, make global changes across the whole plugin, across your whole site. So now to add a review, I just want to go into a post and then uh, find a post that I've written recently or I've created a new post. It's exactly the same process for both. And if I scroll down now, I can see that I have a view option at the bottom and this is the WP Review plugin. I can add a star, point, percentage or circle review type. So for this one, we'll add a star and you can see here we've got um, the two default features that we just added in the global settings. So let's set those to four and five and uh, we'll add in just another feature there. Um, so let's just add another one there. And so you can see there it automatically adds up and gives a total score out of five. You can then tick that to um, change to a location different to the one you've set in the global settings on a per post basis. So for example, we could stick this one before the content, whereas they display by default after. And indeed, you can select custom colors there. You can also set a custom width. So uh, let's perhaps put this one at 100%, um, but the colors will say by default as the one we've set in the global options. And we can also add a heading, so for example, these are my thoughts. You can also add a summary if you'd like. Um, let's just add in some default text there. Or you can indeed tick that box just to hide those there. And finally on the bottom, you have the option to enable or disable user reviews, which are disabled by, by default. Ticking enable and having reviews through comments enabled will mean people can leave their own reviews through the comments. So if you click update there, then you're going to see your post update or publish if it needs publishing. And if we just see what our post looks like, then you'll see at the top, by the, as we selected, 
we have with the colors we wanted these uh, summary of the review with our three features star ratings overall review and you can see user ratings there should people leave them and if we scroll down to the bottom we're going to see people can leave those through comments as well if I just hop to our home page you'll see because we selected the ratings on the thumbnails see we also have on the home page the star ratings that we selected the overall star rating for that review I'm just going to show you a couple of other options you've got for you here um, so if we just go back to our post editor and select another post I'm just going to add another review in quickly to see the different types so we've added the star we can also have a point percentage and let's try a circle here and you'll see the circle gives you one to 100 options so for example um, let's add in just a couple more here so we've got four there um, and you can see we can have one to 100 um, so let's see what we've got there let's make that 10 and finally uh, we'll put in a 50 there and you can set those to add up to whatever you wish um, let's leave this one so it displays after the content by default um, but here we'll change the colors so let's have our view color in this bright yellow and leave everything else as it is and perhaps again set a custom width of 100 in this one I'm going to hide the description um, but we'll add in a review heading and leave user reviews disabled on this one I'm just going to update that post and we'll show you what the circle review type looks like so if we refresh and scroll down to the bottom you can see out of 100 on each of those we've got um, the circle displaying as we selected and you see we also have a numerical display on the left hand side and if we just hop over to our home page then we're going to see we've also got the overall review score displayed in that circle format on the thumbnail as well if we just hop back to our WordPress dashboard I want to show you one more feature of this um, of the WP Review Pro plugin if we go to appearance and then widgets then if we scroll down to the bottom you're going to see that you've got a WP Review widget which displays your widgets in a tabbed sorry which displays your reviews in a tabbed format here you can see you can select the tabs you want so for example top rated most recent most voted or a custom one which brings up a little box down here where you can add in the IDs of the posts you want to display we'll just leave top rated and most recent there and um, we'll disable pagination you can see you can set the different types of reviews to if you only wanted star point or percentage or any to display there we'll leave it on any and let's just show three there and use a vertical layout you can then change the titles so top rated and recent let's just change that to rated and recent and you can also change the order um, so we can swap those around if we'd like hit save and then let's go back to our live site and hit refresh on that and you're going to see if we scroll down here we've got this tabbed area here that show um, the three most recent posts and then the three top rated posts on our sidebar in that tabbed area you can of course go back to the widget area and customize that how you would like it and so that really is all there is to it I just want to emphasize that um, if you go to settings and WP review pro then you have the options here the global options to change where your reviews are displayed throughout your site that's after before or custom using the short code the short code is just straight bracket WP dash review and then close that bracket um, and you can use those to display the review location you can also change all the colors here select the box width add default features change the alignment and also all the thumbnails everything else that the plugin does such as the responsive design and the fast loading are all handled automatically for you hopefully that's of help um, if you have any queries then please don't hesitate to get in touch with one of our support team 
at community.mythemeshop.com. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you.